Hey everybody, this is Christopher Marsh. How you doing? I'm gonna do my uh, <laughs> Reservoir Dogs uh, <laughs> Steve Buscemi impression. <laughs> All right. All right, here are your names. Mr. Blonde, Mr. White, Mr. Blue, Mr. Orange, Mr. Brown, and Mr. Pink. Mr. Pink? Why do I have to be Mr. Pink? Because you're a fucking faggot. <laughs> Well, what, Mr. Brown, come on. Uh, Mr. Brown, doesn't that sound like Mr. Shit? <laughs> you know, why can't we pick our own colors? <laughs> yeah, why, why can't we? No, no way. I pick. <laughs> well, come on, man. I don't want to be Mr. Pink. It sounds like Mr. Pussy. Why can't I be, you know, uh, Mr. Purple? Why can't we pick our own colors? No, oh, doesn't work. Yeah, get... Pick your own colors. You got six guys arguing over who gets to be Mr. Black. And nobody knows each other, so nobody backs down. No way, I pick. I don't know. I think I want to be Mr. Purple. Yeah, that sounds pretty good to me. Well, why don't you just go with your name? Well, it's easier for you to say you're Mr. White. You got a cool sounding name. <laughs> why can't we pick our own colors? No. No way, I pick. Uh, I don't know. I think I'll be Mr. Purple. That sounds good. Yeah. yeah, I'll be Mr. Purple. You should just be glad I haven't called you Mr. Yellow. Your name's Mr. Pink. <laughs> nah, I, I think I'll be uh, Mr. Purple. Yeah, Mr. Purple. That sounds good. <laughs> uh, listen here, Mr. Pink. It's either my way or the highway. <laughs> okay, Jesus Christ, Joe. What do you say, Mr. Pink? <laughs> All right. Let's go to work. <laughs> oh, this blood's scaring me. This blood's scaring me, Larry. I think I'm dying. You're not dying. You hurt. You had real bad, but you're not dying. You're not dying. Come on. Who's a tough guy? Uh, who's a tough guy? Huh? Who's a tough guy? Oh, uh, you can do anything you want to me, but I, I won't talk. I won't say anything. I won't say anything to your boss. My boss? Yeah, your boss. I don't have a boss. <laughs> you can torture me all you want, but I won't say anything. Torture you. Tor torture you. Yeah, that, that, that sounds like a good idea. I, I like that. How about a little fire, Scarecrow? No, oh, don't burn me! <laughs> I swear on the soul of my mother, that's true! In his time, they jingled everything in front of him, but he did his time for four years like a man. So you are going to tell me that after doing four years of prison time that he's just going to decide? Oh, the frickin' blue! To carry money and take the jewels and run! <laughs> Why don't you shut up and tell me what really happened? <laughs> what for? It'll just be more bullshit. <laughs> well, it sounds like a perfectly good story to me. 
But now you weren't there. But, but you know, when we saw how he acted, he was a fucking psycho. <laughs> Antonio, this lump of shit is a cop. Cop? Come on, you don't have any proof. Where's the proof? You don't need proof when you got instinct. Proof? That's your fucking proof? You know, I know we're all seriously emotional here. We're all really pissed. We're all really fucking pissed. <laughs> but come on, Joe. Think about what you're saying. This guy's a fucking cop. He pulls out his gun. <laughs> you shoot that man, you die next. I repeat, you shoot that man, you die next. <laughs> hey, come on, you guys. <laughs> Let's not get carried away here, huh? Come on. <laughs> I mean, you don't want to blow everything over, over just this little... Uh, yeah, on fraction. You know, we've done a lot of jobs together, Larry. We've done a lot of jobs. Let's all settle this down with a conversation. If you were, you shoot that man, you will die next. <laughs> Antonio, this guy is a cop. He wouldn't do that, man. He's a good man. He wouldn't do that. You don't know what you're talking about. They said he's a fucking cop. <laughs> Larry, put the gun down. Larry, don't point that gun in my fucking dad! <laughs> I guess. It's just you and me now. <laughs> I'm sorry, Larry. I'm sorry. I'm a cop. I'm a cop, Larry. I'm a cop. I'm a cop. <laughs> <laughs> they bust him. They put that gun down. Put that gun down, you fucking scumbag! Put that gun down! I'm a cop, Larry! I'm sorry, Larry, I'm a cop! Put that gun down! Put that fucking gun down! Lime in the coconut and burn all up and put the lime in the coconut and burn all up and put the lime in the coconut and burn all up and put the lime in the coconut and burn all up. There's eggs, there's eggs when there's really barely egg. You got a lime in the coconut and burn all up. Say, doctor, with the lime in the coconut and burn all up. Say, doctor. Turn the lime and the coconut bill. Poor Larry. He is a really good guy. He is a good man. It's a shame. I think Fred shouldn't have told him. He should have just let it go. Oh well. <laughs> Take it easy, ladies and gentlemen. Just take it easy, everybody. We'll get through all this. Bye. Take care. <laughs>